Hi friends, welcome back to my page. I'm Peter of Well Love Clothing. Is that how it goes? Yeah. <laughs> Hi friends, welcome back. My name is Addie. I'm Peter. Of Well Loved Clothing. This is my husband. I'm not sure if you've seen him here before. If you haven't, there's a couple of videos with him on here where we went thrifting one time and then another time. <laughs> And Every time we've time. just gone thrifting because <laughs> I also love to thrift. Probably, yes. So, this is kind of just like freeform thrifting. We're not going to be doing anything in particular today. We'll probably find some man things while we thrift. Here's hoping. Here's hoping. It's a lot harder to thrift for men's clothing. If there's clothing. any men out there watching, feel, I feel the struggle. <laughs> thrifting for men is so much harder. If yeah. you're a girl, just the next time you go into like a Goodwill, Pay attention to the size of the men's section versus yeah. the size of the women's section. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It's substantial. It's crazy. <laughs> it's crazy. But we are at my favorite Salvation Army today, which has a really good men's section. Y'all have seen me thrift this place a ton. You'll probably see the same thrift stores that you've seen for a while, but I just think that this will be really fun, and I wanted Peter to join me. I've had a couple of requests for Peter to come back for some videos. People love me. Because we love him. <laughs> and so, <laughs> I just thought it would be a fun little day to just thrift our hearts out not for any particular reason it's starting to get a little bit folly so maybe we'll find some fall stuff Here's what are you looking for today see I want to say sweaters yeah but I already you have too sweaters. many sweaters <laughs> <laughs> they're just great and you can always find they're them always easy to thrift. I need I've been looking for patterned pants for a while oh that's like true. a, a well-fitted like pair of patterned pants I yeah. think would be like Primo okay. Today. So patterned pants. Mm -hmm. I'm sort of looking for some layering pieces, I think. I have a fun little vest set on today and I'm really loving it. And so I think I might want to find some more vests. I'm not really sure. I'm also sourcing some stuff from my store, a couple things for frock boxes, per usual when we go thrifting. So let's head inside. Let's do it. <laughs> Of, of course, we've gone to dresses first. I like dresses. <laughs> oh, it's a vintage Victoria's Secret slip in this really pretty little green color with these stripes. I'm a sucker for a slip dress, especially with a big sweater over it. Thank you. Oh, I got a vintage. Wait, is it vintage? Yeah, vintage rayon. Really cute shorts and shirt with a little collar. These are my favorites. They're very much like this. <laughs> so we have this. <laughs> What'd you find? The next shirt I'm gonna wear. <laughs> it fits me. It's fitting, you know. Like it's really it. flattering. The color is great. It's a great color. <laughs> okay, this is very cute. This is Victoria's Secret. So it's kind of a sleep shirt, but it has that like silky feel. It has a really fun sort of 70s colorful pattern. So I love this. This with like denim shorts, maybe some loafers would be really cute, but also layering it under a slip dress. So very cute. Check the women's section. That's why we're in the women's section because there's so much in the women's section and not much in the men's and you can find cool stuff. See? Flamingo ice cream cones. They're adorable. Will I get it? I don't know, but it's cool. Breaking the action to appreciate this outfit. Look at it. It's so cute. She nailed it. Ladies and gentlemen, she <laughs> is a mood. She is the moment. <laughs> she is Addy. <laughs> Peter this super cute shirt. I love the colors on it and the pattern super fun and modern. He loves these short sleeved collared shirts so this one's great. I'm loving this vintage Gap men's sweater. I like the detail texture on top and the smooth on the bottom. You can see the sweet little Gap tag and some kind of stain. We love a piece that comes with a story but it's a great shape and then I also found this little sweater back here that I think is amazing. The pattern is so pretty so we're gonna grab these for Peter too. We've reached the yellows. This is where it gets dangerous. I already picked up some. <laughs> it's gonna be all yellow by the time we're done with this. Probably. That's probably true. They know that. <laughs> this shirt is very cute. I love the vibrant purple. I love the embroidery detail. It feels very bohemian. I have one frock box that I'm looking for a shirt like this. I think it's a little too bohemian for her taste, but I do think it's really cute and flowy and fun. Okay, this is taking me back to like middle school because it's Free People, but this is a very old Free People logo and tag, but the detail on it is just very like me in middle school with this eyelet right here. 
but you can definitely tell that all these little trendy things are coming back because it's like corset style top but i would have died over this in middle school it's super cute i just i needed to take a second to appreciate this tiger feel good about it it's cool but <laughs> i really like i like a short mc yeah on my shorts because my legs are my best feature Ooh. <laughs> other than my hair <laughs> no i'm just kidding <laughs> but um yeah i like a short inseam because i just like shorter shorts and that's what these look like and they'd be great for like hiking and it looks I, good with your rest shirt too i'm super active yeah and so i need something that's durable those will be cool you should definitely tie those on okay someone dropped off like a bunch of store inventory or something because there's like six pairs of the same pant in different sizes but i love this color it's like a vintage shaped trouser with a tie waist so i really like these but i don't really wear this color blue so i'm not gonna get it but they're very cute look like blood it's kind of terrifying <laughs> it's gotta be from like a halloween costume <laughs> it's only got european sizes in it mm. I also found these super cool, they're chocolate brown. They look kind of black in here, but they're chocolate brown chunky boots. And I love these. These are going to be what I'm wearing all fall with my fancy dresses. And Peter's vibing. <laughs> button on that? It's, it looks like it's supposed to be like muscles, like body. It's got a belly shape. button. <laughs> well, I don't know. I just found the cutest little set. It's a skirt and tube top set. So let me see if I can show you. This is just a little skirt. It's just nice and knit. I think it might be too body con for my taste, but I love the idea of doing this with like a white button down and some chunky boots. I think that's very trendy, but also just cute. I don't know if it's so me with the neutrals, but I've been on a neutral kick today, so We'll see what happens. Okay, I just went through the dress section, so I'm going to show you a couple of the dresses that I'm thinking of getting. This one is for one of my frog box gals. She loves cool tones and florals. I think it's really cute and would fit her perfectly, fit her style really well. So then the next one is this beautiful, I think, handmade dress. It's got this sheer overlay and then this beautiful the damn slip. Get really <laughs> the details. <laughs> With this little Peter Pan collar that you know I love and the ruffles on the sleeve, ruffles on the bottom, and I think it's just beautiful. So I might actually try this one on today. Um, then I found this one. It's definitely a modern brand, but I love this style of dress with this cute, like, fitted detail up here. And it's my size, which is pretty rare, so I'll try that one on. Also, you saw me find this one, but I just think that both of these are really beautiful floral dresses. So, I mean, we'll see what we end up doing here, but I really like both of these. Pretty sure this is the main reason Addy loves the Salvation Army. Look at all of this fabric. <laughs> all of this is secondhand fabric so that much. she can use for her handmade stuff. So, and she's going to look through every single bit of it. Yeah, I am. These are just some pillowcases. I love the vibrancy of them and all the colors in here. I'm thinking that I can do maybe some like quilted jacket situations with them. So that's cool. There's also this beautiful ochre fabric that's just yards of fabric um, for like eight bucks. So that's amazing. 
and then for this one um it's actually that's the inside of it but the outside of it looks like that and i'm thinking i might make a set for peter and give him some patterned pants because it has just these really cool colors that i love and i think would be so cool and it's just a quilt topper so it's like someone started a quilt and then didn't finish it but then i found this really cool quilted piece of fabric too that i think is just really earthy and fun so we'll see what ends up happening here but those are the little fabrics that i found so much stuff which is pretty typical but i'm not usually thrifting with him slash for him and we found a bunch of quilts so we're gonna just go through it i don't think we feel like trying things on today we might, might try a couple try things, like on. things on so we'll show you some of those things but we'll go through everything that we're looking at so let's go through it <laughs> this is the shirt that i found for peter that i was showing y'all i really like it you want to get it i think you should i really like the bold colors this yellow has been really fun recently you don't have any yellow I've got more of like a psychedelic retro thing that I've been leaning into recently <laughs> that I would like really like to get into. So I think this would be a really good start. I love it. I found this really cute Aspen ski sweatshirt too. I grew up skiing here, so this is a sweet little sentimental find. So I have a corduroy problem. A big problem. I really like. It's not a problem. Corduroy is great. Corduroy is <laughs> great, except it's so hot right now. Yeah, that's true. But, um, these are actually some women's pants that I found. They're like a really pretty green corduroy. I'm thinking if they fit me well enough, they could be really cool. So we're gonna try those on? I may even crop them. Oh yeah. So yeah, I'm gonna try these on. Yeah, you should. I also found some stuff for a frock box. This is just a fun little sweater. I'm also getting this for a little frock box. Beautiful silky blouse with that little tie piece. I love it. I also found this really cute little Eiffel Tower sweatshirt and it's embroidered and I'm a sucker for embroidered sweatshirts. I just love the texture and I've been looking for some more kind of graphic tops to wear with skirts and some fun stuff so this one's really cute. We're gonna do a little montage of what we're not getting but stuff that we found. So here we go. <laughs> try some stuff on so I will send you over to him. This is weird. I've never done this before. Um, I don't know. We'll see how it goes. All right, we're starting with bottoms. So these are the shorts that I picked out. The lighting's not great in here, but they're that pretty like green blue color. Like I said, I, I like the shorter inseam. You can see a little bit more on my, my thigh a little bit. Um, for a lot of people, this may not be a short inseam, but comparatively to a lot of shorts that you find in like modern places, this is a fairly short inseam, um, but they fit really well. I like the way they look. I even like kind of how they look with this orange shirt. I think it's a pretty good look. It's got that kind of outdoor urban vibe that I like. So I'm not sure how I feel about the buckle. It's a little strange, but I think I could grow to like it. So I'm probably gonna end up getting these. Okay, I'm loving this dress. The color is amazing. I like this little eyelet or um, keyhole detail right here. And then the length is amazing, especially with that little tear on the bottom. I usually like my dresses just a little bit shorter, just personal preference. So I may tighten these a little, but it's just a cool kind of look. And I honestly think the vest that I was wearing today would be really cool, just draped over this for a casual look. But I don't have anything like this and I'm trying to get a little more blue in my closet because I just like the cool tones. So we'll see, it's very pretty. I'm next with the green corduroy pants is what I've got on now. They don't look too bad. Um, I kind of like a little bit of a cropped. I'd probably crop them a little bit more, maybe up to like here-ish if I was gonna get them. Um, and they look like they fit, but because they're women's pants, they're super high-waisted. So they're not really my vibe, but you gotta try on women's pants, especially in when you're a man thrifting, you've gotta try on some women's stuff because they have better stuff to be honest. But a lot of times it fits a little weird because obviously it's not cut to fit our body type or shape. Um, so I probably won't end up getting these, but they don't look too bad. Okay, this set is super cute. The elastic is completely blown out of the shorts. So I think they'd probably be more like a large anyway, but it's just adorable. I love the buttons on the front. The pattern is so much fun. 
and the shape of the shorts is just awesome so i'm not really sure what i'm gonna do with this it might actually end up in one of my frog boxes because i have a girl who wants separate sets but i love this and it's very cute i love this dress it has a fun kind of nod to the 20s with this flapper feel tiered thing but then in this floral ochre and lavender it's just my colors but i love the tank top with this specific length and i think it'd be super cute belted and even doing it with some little heels for like a garden party type thing but i could also do a turtleneck under here or even a sweater over and those tiers would just add so much to a look so this is a great layering piece but also stands on its own really fun and i do love it with the socks and loafers just kind of a fun take on it so cute yep this jacket is absolutely coming home with me it is so good. All right, moving on to tops. So this is that flamingo shirt with the flamingo ice cream cones. It, it works really well. I kind of like it. Um, it's a little thin, which makes it nice for summer. I'd probably wear some underneath it because um, I honestly feel like you can see through it if this were better lighting. But yeah, I think it works. I wouldn't wear it with these pants necessarily, but um, I really do like it. This is a women's shirt. Like I said, you gotta go to the women's section. It made it really hard to put on. It took me like a little bit, because if you don't know, women's shirts have the buttons on the left side and the hole that the button goes in is on the right side. So it's like a whole different feel. Men's is opposite. Like our buttons are on the right side and the hole is on the left. So like trying to do this with my left hand was very difficult, <laughs> um, but I do like it a lot. And even though it's women's, it fits, it works well. And I really like it. So this is a super cute J. Crew three-piece set. So it's actually a top, a top, and a skirt. And I just love it. The pattern is so much fun. This wide band skirt is so cute. It's just so fun to have a three-piece set like this because you can do so much with it. Even just doing the overshirt with like a little bra top under here to just add some fun flair to an outfit. But I'll show you it without this shirt. So even just this little shirt untucked is super cute here or like tied up would be fun. So. A little three-piece set just has so much versatility and so many options and i could see just the skirt with a little sweater too so we'll see all right this is the last shirt it's kind of a dream i really really like it um, it fits really well i'm filming oh i'm sorry i'm sorry <laughs> addy's bugging me from the stall over so this is kind of a dream shirt i really like it i mean it fits really well um i really love the colors this like mustardy yellow is like a big color for me if you can't tell by the hair and the beard i feel like i walk straight out of the 70s um but it's got a cool retro feel to it it's got like that psychedelic thing um going on which i i truly do want to do more of um, so I think this is a really good start and usually on shirts like this the sleeves are too long and I think on this one the sleeves are like perfect length um, so it doesn't make me feel like a, a dad's bowling shirt or something it, it feels really trendy and cool so I I'm loving it I love this dress so so much oh my gosh I put the slip on and it was already just such a gorgeous slip it has that beautiful detail up here that I knew this dress was going to be amazing, but not this amazing. This is so beautiful. This little collar detail is so cute, and I can't wait to put a sweater over this and have that collar poking out. But then on its own with these beautiful ruffles and this very antique feeling taupe color with these florals is just gorgeous. It has these knife pleats here and a fitted waist and buttons and ruffles. It's just so romantic and sweet i love it with the socks and loafer because it gives it a little hardcore feel but i will definitely be doing this up very ladylike and pretty too maybe with like little pink heels and some fun jewels so this is an amazing dress and i think we're done trying on so let's head out and figure out what we're gonna get okay we have decided what we're going to get okay. i think but we think <laughs> we keep looking at stuff around the store we're but, never totally sure i'm sorry i'm shorter than yeah, you so i'm like <laughs> <laughs> so we we're gonna head to the checkout and then maybe hit a few more stores we don't know we're looking for some furniture today, say, we're so. always looking for furniture yeah so we'll maybe stop into a couple more yeah. stores for furniture and maybe walk through some stuff but for now here we're done I found some stuff. Yeah. It was all in the women's stuff. section, but I found it. No, you found some shit. Hey. The shorts hey. weren't. <laughs> the shorts weren't. And a couple of the shirts. I don't know. That's I don't right. know why I'm right. negating your truth. I know. But, <laughs> because it's wrong. But, we found some really good stuff, if you can't tell. We some found big piece of a huge quilt 
topper, which I'm super excited about. And then one bag. My bag. Ah. And then Peter's bag. <laughs> so we found some really great things at this Salvation Army. Um, stop the crinkle. one more store we'll see where we head so let's do it okay we are at goodwill now goodwill That's we're hitting the two majors intense. sally arm yes. and goodwill <laughs> sally arm sally yes. arm so we're gonna go in this goodwill look for some furniture it'll be a little quicker than last time but we'll still show you some good stuff so let's go this is so cute the embroidery on it is just plain adorable. I love how bright and vibrant it is. Usually it's like a little more old lady -y, but it's got like a cute kind of vintage -y touch. All the best teacher vibes. All the best teacher vibes. Reminds me of something I'm wearing. It does, it's yeah. Yeah, that's true. I think I'm gonna try it. I found this really cool rocking chair. While Addie looks for clothing, I always look at furniture and then men's stuff and then like house stuff, but this chair is really cool. I really like the uh, fabric of it. It's got a cool pattern, cool colors. Peter's just testing out rockers over here. <laughs> this is a really cute little vintage number. I love the little pockets on it with the buttons. That's just very cute, and those pleats are amazing. These are also such flattering dresses because they just kind of suck in and flare out. They're beautiful, but I love the rounded collar, the color. It's got a little situation going on here, so I don't know, but it's cute. I found this really cool jacket. It's that yellow color that I love, that kind of 70s yellow. Um, I've been looking for like a bomber style jacket. This doesn't look like it's quite bomber style, but it's got kind of a cool urban flair with this collar and then like this nice little detail up here. Um, I think it's newer, so it's not quite vintage, but um, I do really like it. I think it's really cool. I might end up trying it on. I guess we'll see. Found a suede. Is it Neiman Marcus? Oh, it has. It's a vintage Neiman Marcus brand. It's cool and nice. I got this round collar. It's really cool. It's that new slick pocket. Let me try it. Oh, that's cool. That's awesome. I think I need it. <laughs> Super vintage. It really completes that outfit. It's not work it, work it, give us a spin. Oh baby, well loved clothing. Okay, this sweater is absolutely amazing. These details are so cool. I love a patterned vintage sweater and it's just got like this funky kind of aztec -y design feel to it, but the colors are amazing. It's got these shoulder pads and a vintage label that says pasta, which I love. So this is super cute. Ooh, that's cool. Oh, wait, let me let me touch it. Oh, that's really cool. It's yeah, it's like really closer. soft on the inside. Oh my gosh, that's awesome. It fits so well. So it's almost got that bomber jacket feel. Yeah. Really Heck yeah, that's cool. I like that a lot. It looks good. Mm. Okay, we don't have a super bowl cart. This is just our little situation that we're working with right here. But we found a couple of good things. So Peter showed you the jacket that he's gonna get, and I've showed you a couple things, but. I'm just going to go through so you know what I am and am not. He loves the light. I'm all about a good flare. <laughs> We're exhausted. It We're is so tired. past lunch time. I don't even want to be filming this, to be I honest. I, this uh, was fun. I love you guys. I don't want to film this, this outro. This is not his full-time job. <laughs> so, thank you so much for thrifting with me and Peter today. Would this you like to fun. say anything? Thanks. Huh. And thanks for watching her videos. Aww, it sweet. makes me really happy because she's awesome at what she does. Affirmation. Affirmation. <laughs> so, I'll see you next week. You want to say with me? You, you are, are well loved. loved. Bye. Bye.